<laughs> oh my gosh. This is like probably the creepiest gallery, shooting gallery I have ever seen. It looks somewhat like a house from 28 weeks later, doesn't it? Even the soundtrack. Hey guys, it's Let Your Light Shine, Pig Productions. We're here at the Winchester Mystery House. Yes, we're being quiet because it's a mystery. But unfortunately, they won't let you videotape inside the house or take pictures, so we're only on the outside. And Sarah, you gotta go check out that shooting gallery over there. It's really creepy. Anyway, so um, we're gonna do our tour. We're just here a little early. And uh, after that, I guess I'll just uh, capture what I can on the outside of this place. And uh, that's, that's a bummer. It's very bummed. Ooh, the music. I'm getting creeped. I'm out. Best vlogging I can do at Winchester House is Ooh, the outside in the gift shop. Talk? I guess she's just gonna pop out a car. That's all she does. All right. Well, that's fine. I guess. Let's see. There's your fortune. I might need a quarter. Is it a good one? Well, I've only got three quarters, so hopefully somebody's got one. Winchester House gummy worms. <laughs> all right. <clears throat> Seen. Uh, I have not yet to see something like that before. Got some cool gadgets here. Portable too, which I like. All right, so I asked the lady um, why the strict policy about not being able to record or take pictures in here is I guess because they're going to do a movie and have copyrights to the house at the moment. So if you if you should show up here years from now, it should be fine. I don't remember getting an issue when I was here about years, I don't know, 15 years ago, 20 years ago? Maybe, yeah, 15 years ago. I don't remember being an issue, but then again, I wasn't vlogging. Um, I don't think I'll take a lot of pictures back then either. I don't remember having a smartphone back then either. So, that's the deal. So, oh well. But it's going to be a fun tour anyway. Some cool shirts, hats, cups, shot glasses, water bottles. Pretty nice gift shop. Just waiting in line for the tour. Guys, we just finished the tour. What'd you guys think of it? Sorry for the shaking. I thought it was pretty cool. Well, scary. Because I'm holding it with my hand. I don't have. Oh, scary. She kept counting. Uh, number 13 is popular in this household. Actually, they're actually, they're actually they have more even numbers than I have here. Oh, okay. Well, then again, they they couldn't explain but why. But she liked. But she really liked. They the really number had no 13. answers. Yeah, but they had no answers is an to why. Lucky number, according to superstition. Yeah. Well, she was also superstitious. And they, got a they had a you know, psychic telling her. So why would she put 13 in there for bad luck? Probably to scare off the ghosties. Anyway, but we're going to try to walk around the front area over here and see what we can capture on the outside because we couldn't it, capture anything on the inside. It does smell good though. It smells like flowers. It smells like flowers. Trust me, it does not. <laughs> Alright. Here we go. Alright, so this is the farm area. And our gardens, of course. We also bought some souvenirs. Steve-O's got a bag full of them. Yep. And there was no I got, budget on this trip. Yeah. Wow, Wait, look at I that. Got, can I tell you guys what I got? I got a really cool keychain. Key this was six dollars. I got a bear. Mm -hmm. It was pretty big. It was like a teddy bear. Yeah, it's a cute it little bear with a, a Winchester, Winchester on it. thing on. 
and now it's 15. So a pretty good price. Yeah, for I would say the gift shop wasn't crazy was, on the, yeah. the prices weren't so bad. We other places we've gone and we had to rethink what we were buying. Yeah, and I got two lip balms. I got a pink one and a blue one, and those were four dollars, I think. Okay, and then I got a shirt. And Lauren got a shirt and a cup. And if you walk in the grounds, like Steve-O said. Alright, the door to nowhere is gonna be over here. Let's see, let's just pan over to this side. Here's the gardens. There it is right there. Door to nowhere. So this is the front of the house. This is the gardens in the front, obviously. Here I'm going to pan over to the infamous house. Okay, I'm gonna walk this way to get the full view. So that would be a main gate right there. What was cool is that her carriage house was indoors so she could have her carriage drop her off inside the house. Ooh, that's cool. Yeah, the washrooms too, they're also indoors. I guess back then you would do your laundry outside. Well, I'm excited to see the movie when it comes out. Yeah. yeah. I believe it's just called Winchester. Hmm. Do you remember the name of the person who is going to star in it? Helen Mirren. Yeah, Helen Mirren. Yeah, I know who she is. I've seen her in movies. That's why I'm like, oh, this is going to be good. They got good cast going. I can't wait to watch it. But you know what we're going to watch first? Titanic. Oh, did this help remind you? Some of the stuff in here, right? Because of that era. Titanic. Some of the stuff that was in here. All right, guys, watching. thank you for watching. We've got to get that house in the background. We can't yes. I gotta just get my head and get the house <laughs> and the other way around. Hope you, uh, sorry it was boring. We didn't get any indoor uh, yeah, that footage. Yeah, was really boring. I was a little bit disappointing, but that's all right. Totally understand. But trust us. It was trust. cool. You um, can get these cards. Oh, yeah, in the gift you shop. I showed it. a dollar. Well, anyway, Very don't forget cool. to like, share, and subscribe. Come on down to San Jose to see the Winchester house. It's fun. And they you have might a couple get your tours. Lucky number. So uh, enjoy. Bye. Bye. Just want to end it with the door to nowhere. Hey, so uh, sorry, the tour's not over. Um, they went back into the gift shop to do some kind of penny thing, and I saw this building ahead. And uh, even though there's a bunch of cars parked over there, it's. From what the gift shop lady said, it's abandoned, and it looks abandoned, so I thought I'd quickly check it out. That's, yes, Winchester House is right behind me. I was spotting this in the tour, because we were like on the third and fourth floors, so you can look down. So, looks like an old movie theater. Now, in Orange County, they used to have theaters look like this, and they were called the Cynodomes. Kind of look at the 57 Freeway and Chapman Avenue. They look very similar to this, and they also closed down years ago. I remember it was a cool place to go. Now, looks like a parking lot for new cars. I have no idea. But yeah, one of the girls um, at the gift shop said she used to go here. So, she remembered when it was open. That's all. It's neat architecture too. All right, oh, there's one over there too. All right, back to the parking lot of the Winchester house. Okay, so I crossed the street. Here I was over here, looked over here. It's not gated. So I thought I'd walk over and take a peek inside. See if I can capture anything.
Oh, it looks neat. Okay, let's see. Hmm. Like a main entrance right here. Yeah, I'm assuming it's an old theater, though. Very old style, too. Look at that. One of these. Probably a ticket booth over here. Oh, yeah, bathrooms. Maybe they're going to make them into something else. That'd be a good idea. All right. Guess that's it. Yep, there was a few of these. What's weird is that when I would go to the Synod Dome over in Orange County, they weren't separated by building. It's like they were all one big building and you would enter inside and go to your dome where your movie theater was. So this is different. Well, they're saying, from what I read just quick, that this Century 21, this particular one, is the only one that had a single screen, and they wanted to save it, have it as a historic landmark. So, yeah, it was a movie theater, and yes, it's closed down and abandoned. All right, thanks for watching. Don't forget to uh, enjoy the Winchester Mystery House. Bye. Just noticed this in the parking lot, too. So, the old movie sign right here. So now it's just a parking lot.